are shifting realities. Chris, I want you to close your eyes, and I want you to imagine a place where anything is possible. And I want you to live out your deepest, darkest, most beautiful fantasies. All right? Just take a deep breath. Close your eyes. Close your eyes. Is that what you want? Take a deep breath. All right? Are you there? Oh, yeah. Are you there? All right. Wake up your eyes. We're here. We're in shifting realities on Reddit. Did we shift? Yes. So welcome to another subreddit review. This time we'll be talking about our shifting realities. Um, Before we get going in earnest, we'll talk about some of the community information. Um, This is a subreddit about shifting realities, as you might imagine, and this subreddit is currently restricted, so you have to become approved before you can post. They've had some instances. Luckily for us, we can still watch and make fun of it from a safe distance. How big is this subreddit, Chris? Oh, 110,000. 110,000 members of That's a shifting lot of members. realities. Yes. That's a lot of reality shifted. Yeah, yeah. So it's um, it's becoming um, probably a recognized disorder at this point. But anyway, it also happens to be a subreddit. So many rules. Right. Let's take a look at at least one of the rules. All right, let's be, be civil. civil. Format post correctly, do not spam. No derailing. Okay. All right, what no, does that nothing mean? Great no there. derailing. Arguments and debating. Can't debate, can't argue. You just Asking for the shifter's method when they share a DR story. You can't ask for their method. You can't question it <clears throat> at all. No questioning. That's, that's a sure sign of a good um, a good subreddit. <laughs> this is a very defensible position that requires no explanation, so don't even ask, bro. All right, so what are we doing? Are we doing hot or are we doing... Uh... I think hot of all time is usually a good way to go. I used to be jealous of my... All right, I mean... Let's take a look, Brent. All right, let's jump right in. Why not start here? Jumping with both feet into the new reality. All right. I don't know if anyone can relate to this, but yes, as the title mentioned, I used to be jealous of myself, thinking that somewhere in this multiverse, my other way was having fun living the life I wanted to live. But! One day a thought crossed my mind. It's not that my other awarenesses are living outside somewhere, but it's the me from the inside who's living all these lives inside the 4D. IDK if it makes sense to you. It doesn't. So I thought I should just change the inside me. If I'm myself, the one who is living all... Jesus Christ. <laughs> I feel like I'm having a stroke. It took me long enough to understand this little shit. Are we on ambient? <laughs> yes, there's... Five comments on that With one. grounding. Wait. Is That's this a like... new term. I, I need to know learn. more about grounding. We're gonna learn. Is it like sounding? <laughs> In the past, I have shifted countless times to similar CR, but with either big changes or subtle changes, which I am pretty sure of, and I am surprisingly good at manifestation but sort of don't know how to work that with shifting. We have missed some chapters. Yeah, I've, you know, I, I know where this guy's coming from. I'm, um, I'm also pretty sure of um, subtle and big... Uh, anyway, this past two months, <laughs> I actively attempted shifting to one of my DRs. All right, we have to figure right, out what we're that... we're going to have to... Okay, hold something on. Something realities. Similar, similar CR. Dimensional realities. Anyway, I had the rollover and hope for the best attempts. I had lucid dreams attempts and I had lay in starfish position for three hours straight attempts. It is exhausting, to be honest. Can you imagine laying on your bed in the starfish position? Is that supposed to... It's, is it, we need to find, like, a guide on this. We do need to, to find shift. a guide. All right, do you want to put a pin in this? Do you want to come back to No, no, to let's it? keep reading this. All right, all right. Uh, but laying in that position and doing my method is what makes me mini-shift if what I experience is mini-shifting. I hear it sounds scripted. Not sure if it's just in my head, but a win is a win. What? Mm-hmm. Smell vivid scents that I scripted, feeling the light and atmosphere change, etc. But never fucking... This is ambient. What do we... I can't follow this. Yesterday, I was so sure I had my signs, my motivation, my mindset, everything. It's not like I need them, but you know. In the beginning of my shifting journey... No periods, by the way, in this entire fucking thing. Not a one. In the beginning of my shifting journey, I had scripted that I'll see lavender the day I will shift. I know for a fact that I doesn't change a thing, but it makes me so happy. Before we go to the comments... What does any of that mean? This guy tried to mini-shift, and I think what he's saying is that his tell, he would know that he shifted if he smelled lavender. And I think he was successful, but I think the starfish position took a long time. Took a long time. It was very exhausting. Uh, Yes. (laughs) So I think he wants to know if he should focus more on grounding and jamming that lavender into his pee hole. Let's see what the comments have to say. Congrats! You were there. Okay. For the grounding, when I'm attempting to shift, I imagine myself being already there and not focusing on anything else. If I have unwanted thoughts while attempting, I'm telling myself that you're not real. 
you happy? Desired reality, current reality. Is this like very popular overseas? Like the, the grammatical errors are kind of uh, a, a trend. You, gra- <sighs> you really need to proofread these. Um, I think this post would be great for sharing tips and stories to new shifters and shifters who are still trying to shift for the very first time. If I hear the word fucking shift one more fucking time. It's like a Fast and the Furious movie. Okay, I, I don't know what it is yet, though. Like, I would recommend... We're trying to piece this together from, like, outside... Okay. Well, I told you, you close your eyes and you focus on the different reality and you put yourself there. You're shifting into a different reality. That, at its baseline, Hold on. is what they're talking about. What does this mean? Has anyone mastered shifting? I still don't even know what this is about. Are you able to shift whenever and wherever you like? I have mastered lucid dreaming. I can lucid dream pretty often, easily, and with intention. I can do it every night. How can I master shifting the same way I mastered lucid dreaming? What really helped with lucid dreaming is doing practical methods like reality checks. Are there any... There's some irony in there. (laughs) Alright, let's see what practical advice we have. There's 19 comments on this bad boy. Shift and shifting. Jesus Christ. They should just rename this the Fast and Furious (laughs) side. I have not a master yet, but I've had the privilege of being this community before 2020, so I met some of them. Wait, what? Did they shift out? They must have shifted out. What is the lore here? <laughs> I know a little bit about the lore, but I'm saving it. Oh my god. The, the most notorious trace of a master shifter is freedom. They are free from anything at this point and can easily shift at will. They are also creators of methods and new concepts. I've never seen a master shifter that didn't have their own methods, ideology, morals, and shifting beliefs. Sometimes they share, and sometimes they keep themselves in shadows. Shifting is a skill that needs time to be polished. It's common to see shifters that shift within a week. Right, they're all just insane, right? But yes! Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> what do you think we're here for? I, I was starting to question things. Can I just wake up and things will be better? No. Is that a thing? No. As much Can as you would just... like to believe. What is this? It's like, the... who are these... Who are these 110,000 people? My guess is that it has something to do with, like, quantum realities or something. Have you ever heard of that quantum suicide thing? But they have to wake up in the same place, right? Like, they have the same account. It's very subtly different. Is it the same internet throughout the multiverse? It's very subtly different. Or they wake up and they convince themselves that, like, things are very specifically different. But this, this, this particular phrase right here really has me wondering. Yeah, I do know. I will tell you that if we do a deep dive... Um, we will learn that the guy who oh, the best shifter. came up with this terminology and, and launched this whole idea originally came out recently and told everyone that it was a joke. And <laughs> yes. he managed to snag in 110,000 people on Reddit alone uh, with a jokey joke. So, so he, And it's still going without him. Yeah. Like, nah, it's real. No, it's, yeah. So just keep that in mind. The guy who started this said it was a joke. How long has she been shifting? Like, not this reality time, but also I've spent in other reality... Yeah. She said in Are some of her videos... Are they on DMT and cough syrup? Well, ambient, it seems like. It's very disjointed. My just reality. because you close your mind, your eyes, and you think of something, that doesn't mean it's real. <laughs> that doesn't mean... Philosophy gets into this somewhat deeply in, like, platonic ideals. Oh, my like... God. This is... You probably get itchy when trying to relax because it's what happens when the body falls asleep. You stay, you just ignore it and it'll stop. Yeah, this is some good advice here. I think I've been shifting to parallel realities without noticing. But not to my DR yet. Is that desired reality? I think so. But I do think it's preparing me for that. Long story short, little things have been different. A single color change in a country flag. Can we have an example, please? <laughs> like, I know Irish and Italian are similar. The next time being a different color. <laughs> okay, did you just get new glasses? Like, what? <laughs> Heck, even comments on random unrelated YouTube videos about how this universe is different. Pedro, Pedro Pascal. Pas- <laughs> All right, just throw me for a loop now. Pedro Pascal news just came out about him starting filming for Fantastic Four. Pretty sure they never announced any news of that casting before this in my previous reality. What? How can we confirm that? Anyway, the funny thing is, I'm trying to perma shift and forget my memories of my current reality. You found a good one. That's an important note to make because. So she's killed herself. The things that, that's quantum suicide. There's probably a sub for that if you want to get oh into God. it. Oh God! You die forever. You have to shift. No, basically that idea is that like you're only one alternate reality away from living a much better version of your life, 
and you get there by dying in this reality. <sighs> so I, there's probably Reddit probably stamped that one out, stomp that one out. Hey, um, this is bad. <laughs> Anything? That's what the other one was warning us about. Do you want to, like, do you want to see it? See no, no. Let's, <laughs> let's finish with this shit. Um, the Pedro Pascal thing is completely off. He's from yes. her other universe. Oh my god. It's, what? Everyone already knew this, so it's been... St- Maybe I just didn't know it. Yes! That, that's a hundred percent... That is a hundred percent what happened. This is just one reality, and yeah, you could you could. When sit down did and, this happen? <laughs> <laughs> These people trust their memories way too much. I don't even keep up to date with Marvel, but what I would have seen the news about him is Richards. Is that what this subreddit yeah, is? That's okay. how you can tell. Yeah, we found it. All right, now we found it. Okay, <laughs> it always takes a few minutes, but we do find it eventually. Like exactly the brand of crazy. Uh, uh, yeah, they're very very certain about things that are. Um, it's like the universe realizes I want to shift and have some doubts, but it give me tiny signs here and there that it's possible. I just have to get the best parrier of my mind. You can click. Can we click on that person's profile? This one? Yeah. Uh, I want to see yes, we can. Have. Okay. So they're in shifting realities a lot. Let's check. Their I posts. don't like this. You can just look what any person posts in any subreddit. Yeah. <laughs> okay. It's awesome. Reality shifting. Wait, there's two. There's reality shifting and shifting realities. Uh oh. Oh my god. All right. Anyway, let's let's see what else they're into. It's all these. It's sometimes, oh, that sucks. Sometimes you can get a real interesting look at someone's history. Oh, they like fucking horses. Cool. Let's look at posts or comments. Let's look at comments. Comments. Where do they post or where do they comment? It's it's all these two. That sucks. All right. That's boring. Because it would be great if it was like weird hentai shit. All right. Let's see. Same. <laughs> My dad used to own a red muscle that I could ride too. Later, he sold it off and purchased another one, which I clearly remember looked way different from the red one. Dark blue and much bulkier and larger. Well, I often said it was way more heavier than the red one. That is not English. <laughs> I'd yeah, never write like it for Indian that thing? reason. Also, the red one stood out like it was a darker shade of red with a brown leather seat. Super cute. What? You just said it was blue, not red. The new one looked like my any other bike. My mom agreed she said the red one was much better. Now when I saw it again for months, the bike is exactly the same size as the model as the red one except for the color. My dad and mom both needed the same money bought after the right one, but I'm seriously stumped. It's possible that your parents are aging and, and maybe forgetting things they said, but that <laughs> that would be somewhat normal. I'm in a similar situation to I you. I don't want to... Jesus Christ. Why is the Reed Richards thing keep coming up? Also, I remember that a completely different actor played Reed Richards in the 2004 Fantastic Four movie. That, well, that is true, but <laughs> yeah, it, it doesn't is. have any bearing on this conversation. <laughs> it's not fall. <laughs> They're all talking about just the Fantastic Fucking Four. <laughs> I hope the further we go down, it just devolves more into. T- <laughs> John Krasinski the thing is would have been gay. <laughs> <laughs> That's it. The latest thing I've witnessed, which made me believe maybe I'm in a new place, was I lost my glue stick randomly after I woke up in my bed. So I put it beside my. Why, pray tell, are we sleeping with a glue stick? You gotta huff it. That's how you gotta get to bed. <laughs> You gotta huff that glue, baby. Huff the cat food. Yeah. <laughs> so I put it beside my bed. That night I couldn't wait to stick all the pictures I found on my wall, but I was too sleepy to do anything, so I thought maybe I would do it tomorrow. These are 10-year-olds, yeah. <laughs> I was too sweepy. My glue stick disappeared from my bed. I'm in a new universe. I just lost it. I don't have a clue where it was. I doubt my three-year-old sister came to my room and... S- you should have just edited that sentence out, because now that's exactly what happened. You're a 10-year-old. <laughs> solution yeah i just got one of these yesterday there was this character in a book i was reading he had a different last name and i searched everywhere thinking what the fuck this Uh website doesn't even know the character's name but no (laughs) it's what they said it was and then i went okay shifting happened by itself i can't (laughs) this guy so confident this guy real hold on no let's let's follow this guy this guy truly believes yeah this guy right here truly believes that he didn't just remember something or spell it wrong. That the whole reality shifted. Yeah. that's It's crazy narcissism or confidence. All right, here we got posts. Ready? Has Boo. Posts. What's overview? Mostly comments and all comments. Merlin Fick? Hell okay. yeah. Merlin Fick. <laughs> Webtoons. This is Harry this Potter fan time. fiction. Yeah. <laughs> Doctor Who. We found it, dude. Our help. Children of Light. 
like my TikTok that had 12k views now is 9k and the rest <laughs> that really fucked when I remember have 1k plus <laughs> Wait, Pedro Pascal's what? This is them signaling that they're currently in a new universe and they didn't realize until just now. They woke up. Yeah. They broke free of the Matrix. Wait, Pedro Pascal? This is just, <sighs> yeah, it's a bunch of 12-year-olds talking to themselves and talking themselves into um, to dumb bullshit. How many of their uncles do you think work at Nintendo? <laughs> <laughs> Any questions? So many <laughs> accidentally shifting back. Oh, when you're fake, when you wake I'm up, back. no, I found the glue stick. <laughs> Shit, take me back. That was in my ass. <laughs> Basically, a mini shift. So confident, too. They don't crown themselves. <laughs> and then they're arguing with the person who said mini shift. Um, oh, okay, here's the thing. The new to me, but this is technically something new, so I guess grounding yourself is necessary when shifting for the first time. I'm they approach it so scientifically. <laughs> well, you know, time ratios are different from... What the fuck does this mean? It could have been two weeks in the air, but two minutes or seconds here. You never know. All like a candle. <laughs> After no you such do a bunch of cough syrup. <laughs> no such thing as a mini shift. You shifted or you didn't. Please don't use terms that overcomplicate shifts. Let's look at that guy's profile. <laughs> so I'll take a step back here. <laughs> 